Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about Supergirl Season 6. We're going to be talking about the final season again. This week is mainly going to be Supergirl videos, answering your questions, and talking about some theories and ideas as to how Supergirl will end, because obviously we got the big news a few days ago that Supergirl is officially ending at the end of Season 6. So, yeah, I think it's fitting that this week is a sort of Supergirl week, sort of talking about what could happen and everything like that and obviously as we head towards Supergirl coming back sometime you know summer or like springtime later next year we need to theorize about all of this so I thought you know I'll send out some questions what do you guys think you guys have sent in some questions I said you know what do you have any questions about the ending of Supergirl season 6 and obviously the show ending so you guys have sent in some stuff and leave any video recommendations you want in regards to Supergirl in the comments down below as I'll be sure to get around to it because I know a lot of you have a lot of questions you know there's been so many sent in I can only do like five or so in this video so I'll continue answering your different questions as we head towards next year okay so Stefan24 on YouTube asks how do you imagine Supergirl leaving the show will she die a hero like Oliver or perhaps leave and never come back Maybe she goes to the future with Monel, perhaps. So that's a good question, and there's a few more like that. You know, how will Supergirl end? How will the show end? I think there is, you know, a possibility that it can go one way, but also there's a very strong possibility that the way it's going to end is she could die. However, if we're talking about how I think the show is going to end, I don't think Supergirl's going to die. I don't think she's going to die like a hero's death like Oliver. I think she will actually probably just leave and live a normal life. I think it was different circumstances for Oliver Queen because he was, you know, the original hero. His ending was tied into Crisis and Crisis is such a big event that I think Oliver had to die for the show to end. However, I don't think that is the case with Supergirl and I think Supergirl will come off, well, sort of leave and then not come back. However, there is a chance she could cameo again in the future. We'll have to talk about that. That is another topic for another day. However, maybe, like you said, maybe she goes to the future with Monel, perhaps. Obviously, that would be the happy ending we would love. Because, you know, in real life, Melissa and Chris just had their child. Congrats to them. Imagine if that was the way the show ended, that she just goes to the future. She joins the Legion of Superheroes like she does in the comics. She actually does join the Legion of Superheroes. And she's just in the future with mon -El. I think that's very fitting. That would be the way that I would love the show to end. If she just went to the future. Legion of Superheroes. With mon -El. That would be perfect for me. And I know a lot of you guys. However, there is a very, very slim chance of that happening. Because I don't know if Chris is going to show up as mon -El anytime soon. Maybe he'll make one cameo before the show ends. However, I think it's unlikely even though that's the way I would love the show to end. But I still don't think she's going to die a hero's death. I don't think she's going to die. I think she will just go away somewhere. Okay, so let's move on to the next question. This is Leaper on YouTube who asks, Is there a possibility that someone from the Supergirl characters will die in this last season? Maybe even Supergirl. So that is a very, very valid question. Lots of people have been asking this question, you know, will anyone die? I think it's kind of inevitability. The CW shows, the Arrowverse shows, they love to put in the sort of threat of death. And, you know, a lot of these characters do die off. So there is a chance that one of them could die before the end of the season. But is there a chance that Supergirl will die? I just talked about that. I think it's very, very unlikely. It's still possible that they may want to end the show like that. However, I think it's very unlikely that anyone like Alex or John will die because they're such big characters and I don't think you know although it would be very impactful if they did die that would affect Supergirl I don't think they're going to do that this season so a character doesn't have to die every season I think if no one dies I think it's just you know the fact that they're carrying on and you know they're just part of the show I don't think we always need deaths but it does bring some sort of tension it brings you know an interesting part to the story I think there is a chance that maybe Lena could die because, you know, whatever Lex is up to, I think there is definitely a chance. It could be Lena, I think it could be Nia, it could be Brainy. Probably Brainy is probably the most likely in my mind. I don't know why, but I kind of feel like he could be killed off. And then there's the chance of William. We thought William was going to die last season, 
because there was that scene where he got kidnapped, but that didn't turn out to happen. So yeah, let me know in the comments down below, do you have any theories, do you think any characters from Supergirl will die in the final season, or do you think Supergirl will die the hero's death at the end? Okay, so Chris on YouTube asks, do you think Lena will survive the season or ultimately suffer the same fate as her Smallville counterpart? Well, I can't comment on Smallville because I actually haven't fully watched the show, so I don't know how her counterpart actually ends, you know, when the show ends. However, will Lena survive the season? I think there is a definite chance that she will survive the season, but we still got the lingering Lex story. And, you know, considering their relationship, you know, they are, you know, kind of co-workers sometimes. But since Lena has, you know, got back in the good arms and the good graces of Team Supergirl and Kara, she's back on that side, so there is a chance that Lex could kill her because she's working for Supergirl. And, you know, whatever Lex is planning with his mum, they're planning something big and we're going to see that at the start of the season. So there's a chance that Lena could be affected by that and maybe killed off. Or, you know, maybe at the end of the season, she is one of the characters that gets killed off. But let's move on to the next question, and this comes from Caroline on YouTube, who asks, Will Supergirl defeat Lex? And will Kara have a relationship with William, and is Brainy going to die? So that's a few questions in one, and I think Supergirl will definitely defeat Lex this season, considering it is the last season after all. I think they need to get rid of all the threats they've got out there, whoever is the main villain of the season, whether it continues to be Leviathan, whether it continues to be Lex, or it's a new person, I'm guessing it's going to be a new person, they're going to defeat Lex because they planned to do that at the end of the season if they had their normal episode count, but they didn't get to do episode 20, so they weren't able to actually get to the point where they would defeat Lex, but the writers have been rewriting it and They've changed the course and I think Lex will be around at least for a few episodes more than he was originally planned to be. He was planned to be defeated and he will be defeated but sometime, you know, this season, but yeah, it will happen. Okay, and Kara's relationship with William, will that happen? So this has been something that was teased last season, we know that Melissa has teased something to do with this. I mean, I know some of you are fans. I guess I'm kind of a fan, like I don't mind it, but obviously I kind of know that Monel is not going to come back, but like I said earlier in the video, I think it'd be very fitting if she went off to the future with Legion and that's how they ended the show, considering real life circumstances with Melissa and Chris. However, I know it's a TV show, so I'm not against William. I think William's good, I've been liking him a lot more, I think he's come to be a good character. And so I think, you know, with Melissa teasing and with the showrunners teasing and them setting up the storyline, I think at some point in the season we're going to see them at least try and get together. Trying to be maybe in a relationship or they just like go out together. And so I think Kara and William have potential to be a thing this season. I think maybe they'll get to that, but they might change their minds and they might not fully go through with it because they were planning something this season, but then they didn't fully go through with it. Maybe they had some second thoughts about it. I'm not sure. We'll have to wait and see, but I think there is a chance that William could be with Kara this season. And so is Brainy going to die? I talked about this and I said, you know, he's probably one of the most likely characters to die. I would say he's at the top of my kill list, not because I don't like Brainy, I like Brainy, but... I feel like he's the easiest to kill off because he can still exist even if he dies, you know, he can find a way to be in like some sort of AI system or, you know, something like that. Anyway, let's move on to the next question. This comes from Speedy06R on YouTube who asks, do you think Cat Grant will come back for the season? So like talking about mon and talking about, you know, other characters out there, especially Cat Grant, we've all been sort of waiting for them to return. Obviously, in the 100th episode last year, we got Monel returning, we got Wynn returning, we got Rain returning, we had some really, really amazing cameos. However, we haven't seen Cat Grant in a long time. I believe the last time was season 2, maybe? Potentially one episode in season 3. We'll have to think back and look back. You guys can correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure the last time was season 2. So, I think it's unlikely that Cat Grant will come back. However, there is always a chance because she was a big character in the show and maybe they convinced Callista Flockhart to fly up all the way to Vancouver. However, 
there is a thing right now including restrictions and I don't know how it's going to be by the time they finish the season and they finish filming but right now it seems there are going to be less guest stars on the show considering that everyone would have to travel and then quarantine for two weeks and then do their guest star cameo so I think it's less of a chance we're going to get cameos this season however considering it's the last season maybe they make some sort of exception they're like oh it's the last season I'll come back I'll get paid I'll be in this episode so we'll have to wait and see okay so the final question comes from Greg Townsend on YouTube who asks Hey Ben, do you think it's possible Melissa could ever change her heart and do season 7? So, I mean, it's an optimistic question and I really, really hope she does, but there is a 0.000001 chance because they have talked it out, they've gone through the contracts, they have figured it out with the CW, Warner Brothers, Belanti Productions and Melissa, and I'm guessing the rest of the cast and crew. So there is extremely low chance of this happening because they've already planned out the rest of the season. They are currently writing it right now. They're figuring out ways to end the season. They've, you know, figured out the contracts. Melissa's contract's up. Melissa has her kid now. That was just announced. Huxley, Robert Wood, congrats to them once again. And considering that they've officially made an announcement, they're not just going to go back on that announcement and be like yeah there's gonna be a season seven so even though melissa loves supergirl and we know she loves supergirl i don't think it's possible that melissa could have a change of heart and do season seven not just because i don't think she wants to do it because i know she loves supergirl but it's the fact of the logistics they sorted everything out they are ending this season so i guess it would be a bit too wishful of us to think oh maybe she'll come back However, that is not discounting her returning at any time to any of the shows because I think, like with Stephen Amell, there is a chance that Melissa will return in cameo roles in, say, some crossovers and stuff like that. So we'll have to wait and see. I'm going to have a video on that pretty soon, talking about, you know, if Melissa will return. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please support the channel by leaving a like, a comment, and also turning on notifications so you don't miss any videos. I'm trying to upload daily at the moment. So it would really mean the world to me if you watch every single video no matter the topic. So Supergirl week right now because, you know, we need to talk about this final season. And we've got a lot to talk about. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Goodbye. I see red.